In today's video, I will teach you how to blur the background in GIMP. Let's get started. Blurring the background in GIMP involves creating a selection of the foreground subject, then applying a blur effect to the remaining background. Here's a step-by-step -step guide on how to blur the background in GIMP. First, launch GIMP, then open the image that you want to work on by going to the menu bar, go to File, then Open. Then select the image that you want to edit. The next step is duplicating the background layer. In the Layers panel, right-click on the background layer and choose Duplicate Layer. This ensures you're working on a copy of the original image. The next step is to create a selection of the foreground subject. For this, you can use the Foreground Select tool, which is sometimes referred to as the Scissor Select tool. You can find it in the toolbox or by simply pressing F as a shortcut key. Now, carefully trace around the foreground subject. Click to add anchor points and close the selection by connecting the last point to the first one. GIMP will then attempt to create a selection based on the traced outline. The next step is to refine the selection. After creating the initial selection, you may need to refine it. Use the Paths tool or simply use the shortcut key B, then adjust and fine-tune the selection by modifying the anchor points and curves. Once you're satisfied with the selection, go to the menu bar, go to Select, then choose the path to convert the selection to a path. Now, go to Select, then select Invert to select the background. Now, we're finally applying the blur. With the background selected, go to the menu bar, go to Filters, Blur, then Gaussian Blur. Then adjust the radius slider to control the intensity of the blur. And make sure to enable the preview option to see the changes in real time. Then click OK to apply the blur. If needed, you can refine the edges of the blurred area using tools like Eraser Tool or the Brush Tool with a soft brush to create a smoother transition between the blurred and sharp areas. Now make additional adjustments if necessary. And once you're satisfied, save your edited image by going to the menu bar, go to File, then select Export As, and choose your preferred file format. And that's it! You've successfully blurred the background in GIMP while keeping the foreground subject sharp. If you find this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. And if you want to see more tutorials, turn on the notification bell to get notified whenever we upload new videos.